Sunday was National Ice Cream Day. Today is National Vanilla Ice Cream Day. Apparently, Vanilla Ice Cream gets its own day. Yes. Who knew? So, so I had to pick out a whole new outfit right. because they're really different. They're totally different days. Uh, great to say hello to Jamie Eckert from Celebrity Cafe and Bakery. Lead Baker, hello. Hi, thank you for having Celebrity here again. We're so excited to be back. Uh, yes. Oh, one of my favorite places. And uh, you, you put gloves on us. I, yes. I, I guess we're getting dirty? Y'all might be getting dirty. Okay, what are, what are we doing today? Well, we're making pairings with vanilla ice cream to help okay. celebrate the holiday. So these are all treats you can either make at home or go out and get yourself. Okay. So we're going to start off with a hot fudge brownie sundae. Yes. Now these are one of my favorites <laughs> from when I was a child. And you can do just a typical brownie or just spice it up a little bit at home in your uh, brownie batter. You okay. can add in like white chocolate chips. You can oh. add in M&M's. Yes. You can cut up some Andes mints. Oh, I like that uh, idea. Reese's, chocolate okay. and peanut butter. That's okay. one of my favorites. Okay. So once you have your brownies baked, if they aren't hot out of the oven, you want to microwave them about 10 to 15 seconds. And then after you microwave them, you're going to scoop on the best part, vanilla ice cream. Now, the microwaving is good. Why? Because, um, because just... the hot brownie mixed with the cold ice cream, uh, it just kind of blends it all together. Yes, okay. You don't want to hit the add 30 seconds. It'll be too no, long. No, no, no. Okay. okay. So once you get the ice cream on there, you're just going to add on your hot f your hot fudge. There's a little on there. Mm. And if you want... If you want to add some toppings, yes. some whipped cream. Do you want to add anything else? Of course, else? of course. Oh, okay. Add on. Okay, so let's go to the pie now. Yes. So if you want to do same thing, if it's not fresh out of the oven, you want to just microwave it about 10 to 15 seconds. Okay. And with your pie, if you're making it homemade, you can always buy a store-bought crust. Okay. No one will ever know. That's going to save you some time. It'll save you some time. There you go. Yes. Right. So once you have the hot pie, you're just going to add on your ice cream again, your vanilla ice cream. And there's your dessert there. This one here is an apple pie. You can always switch it up with another fruit. And I like caramels. So I would drizzle some caramel on that ice cream with the apple. Yum, it's yum, really yum. Good. Now, when it comes to uh, cake, you say is it to add sour cream? Yes, you can. You can add sour cream to any of your cake mixes, and it'll make it really, really moist, and so your cake doesn't get dry and crumbly. Okay. So this one here we have is a white chocolate topper cake. It's got caramel um, and pecans inside. Same thing, microwave it if it's not fresh out of the oven. You're going to add your ice cream so you can have either cake or ice cream or pie and ice cream. Once again, the hot cake mixed with the melted ice cream. Just delicious. Yes. Okay, now you're doing cookie sandwiches, I heard. Yes. <laughs> Y'all ready to And you said basically to, to keep them in containers like this. Yes. Keep your right? cookies in a Tupperware with a piece of bread. With the, a piece of bread. With a piece of bread. The bread will soak, um, the moisture will soak from the bread into the cookies. And keep oh. your cookies really, really moist. And we're going to do ice cream sandwiches? Yes. Is that what we have yes. our, our things for? Oh, you right. got our cookies already ready. Okay. Yes. Yum, yum, yum. So I'll help y'all out here. And um, as we're doing this, we want to let everyone know. So you guys are going to be moving your Highland Park location, right? We are. We okay. are moving. It's just oh. about a mile down the road. Yes. Okay. I, complete, I will complete Not the sandwich. Not too far. Yeah, you go ahead, Dan. You, you get to work. How about and that? And then uh, you still have the one in Colleyville, one in Frisco, one in North Dallas as well. So several celebrity bakery and uh, cafe locations. And we'll put all the information on our website, fox4news.com. And ooh. Thank yeah. you for celebrating National Vanilla Ice Cream Day with us. We appreciate yeah. it. <laughs> we'll be right back.